Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini, January 15, 2023. The moon spends the day in your solar house, and the desire for more warmth, safety, and familiarity is strong. There can be some restlessness to manage today, but a Sun-Neptune transit helps you pace yourself, slowing you down just enough to enjoy your time. Rapport with others can be almost telepathic this transit connects you with others who help with a lucky break or valuable life lesson. As you look at a problem or situation in a new light or put your faith in someone, or something, you find it easier to relax. You may receive good reviews or feedback. It's particularly wise to listen and learn today. Treating all as equals can be enlightening and can open doors. Buckle up for a sweet and sugary day. You'll feel in touch with the universe on a cosmic level. The mighty sun, now orbiting across the sky from you in your solar house of partnership, will peer over to majestic Neptune who is spinning in your solar house of expansion. This ensures that you could feel an especially spiritual connection to your lover today, especially if you're willing to bring philosophy, magic, or religion into your rapport and routine. Consider ways of expanding your soul connection and it could happen organically. Try not to cut your nose off to spite your face. It might be time to lay old issues to rest to focus on strengthening your work friendships when Mercury retrograde in Capricorn trines the North Node in Taurus. The earthy trine could even be your incentive to even commit to pursuing old aspirations or goals in your career path. Since the Sun in Capricorn will also sextile Neptune in Pisces, you may feel optimistic while committing to a more fulfilling professional journey. However, have a clear idea about what you are committing to in your career path. Just days after his friendly aspect to Venus in your financial sector, Mars is in his first full day in direct motion in an intuitive and imaginative part of your chart and looking to the future. The Moon's friendly aspect to both Venus and Mars is helping to amplify your financial confidence, instincts and imagination, as well as reigniting your fighting spirit. Today's favorable planetary transit is a wonderful aspect for communicating with friends who mean a lot to you. Communication of all kinds appeals to you, spoken, visual, artistic, and physical. To know what you are truly feeling, it's helpful to get some regular physical exercise that allows your body to speak to you. Once you know what you feel, you are more able to communicate with those people you truly care about. This day was designed just for you. On this day your dedication is sure to show through, and you may even be acknowledged from some unexpected source. Do not try to overanalyze the sincerity of this recognition. Just accept it and go from there. Be careful in business meetings that you do not take an overly firm stance if what you feel is the more logical approach to the problem is not the one that is chosen by the majority. For the most part, this day will go exactly as you have planned. While Mars won't return to Cancer to begin a new and belated new two-year Mars cycle until March, his direct turn yesterday means that he is now moving back towards rather than away from your sign. With Mars' journey back to Cancer stalled for the last two and a half months, just news that the journey has now been resumed is cause for excitement. Yet this comes when there is also a more general awakening of your passions, warrior and competitive spirit. A flame is being lit from within. The moon's departure from your communication sector yesterday has left you with more than just the means to keep the communication lines open. It was a friendly aspect to the sun in your relationship sector before leaving that not only made it easier to channel this into your relationships, but back in harmony after a full moon last week this leaves you with a new sense of confidence. Our eyes in the sky. The Libra moon aims to harmonize relationships, but the juxtaposing energies of Mercury retrograde, Mars retrograde, Venus, and Jupiter can cause anxiety around relationships. Discuss your feelings with others in order to understand why you're anxious. Don't shy away from being honest. It can help relationships change for the better. You radiate warm feelings and are approachable. People appreciate this, and if you have a partner they return the affection you show. Use this time to do something unusual that you're unlikely to forget. 
If single, you can use your sensitive manner to assist others. The empathy you demonstrate to those you care for has a stimulating effect. You have to face up to an inner test of strength, constantly pressured by other people's problems. They might even hurt your feelings or wind you up. Take a constructive approach to this difficult situation by seeing it as an opportunity to strengthen your own position and to emerge from the argument with greater self-confidence. It seems you're able to see everything clearly and feel confident about the positions you take. The problem is others do not share your point of view and think they are right. It is important not to forget there are no truths that aren't unbiased truths. Let the others talk without automatically taking the opposite position, avoid unnecessary difficulties. Your finances won't do so well today so be careful or you might suffer losses. Some people will try to take you for a ride. Be skeptical of advice others give you. Some of them could well be self-seeking and dishonest, thinking only of their own interests. In the morning, the Capricorn sun sextiles Neptune in Pisces, inspiring us to give back to others. We see our accomplishments as conduits for charitable acts. We would not have achieved success in our chosen occupations or professional ventures without people helping us out along the way. Now that we have established ourselves, we can use our influence to pay it forward, giving others a leg up when they need it most. At this time, we can also expect to receive insight on how to use creative inspiration to boost our profile. Pay attention to chance encounters and stay receptive to spiritual guidance that comes in unexpected packages. You apply yourself to a subject that has stimulated your interest over a sustained period. It's easier for you to obtain the necessary focus you need and you're more motivated than you have ever been before. Use this newfound enthusiasm and concentrate on making contacts to solve any outstanding issues needed for a successful outcome. You've enough strength to undertake any strenuous task you put your mind to. Free yourself from psychological burdens and any harmful vices you might have. You've the ability to master new physical challenges. Harness this new enthusiasm and think how your attitude helps you endure in difficult times. Late in the morning, the Libra moon trines Mars, which has just stationed direct in Gemini. This aspect offers us charisma, helping us to chase our passions with gusto. We are re-energized following a lengthy lack of motivation during Mars retrograde. Now, our wheels begin to spin again. We can harness this transit should we need an extra boost of courage to ask someone out on a date or approach a boss about leading an important project. With newfound enthusiasm, we pursue our desires single-mindedly without coming off as aggressive.